Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the 45th President of the United States, Donald J. Trump. Thank you very much. What a great honor. These events are going on all over, all over the city. We're having a lot of fun tonight. And I want to tell you what a day it's been. Our First Lady has been working very, very hard. Very, very hard. But I just want to thank you on behalf of Melania and myself and the family and really millions and millions of people all over the world. The job you've done is absolutely incredible. Absolutely incredible. Because this is our military. This is our law enforcement. This is our first responders. You're amazing people. You're amazing people. And I like you for a lot of reasons. Also, I like the fact that you all voted for me. Right? You all voted for me. <laughs> That's right. I just, I just met your Joint Chiefs of Staff. And they are incredible. And I'll tell you what, they know what to do, and they know what to do, and they know what to do fast. And we're going to see what happens. But we have a great country, and we want to do what's appropriate. We've been pushed around by a lot of different people. Lots of bad things are happening. But I think you're going to see a big improvement, really. And I just want to tell you that General Mattis was just approved by the Senate. First one, General Kelly was just approved by the Senate. And uh, wouldn't it, isn't it something? Two generals are the first ones. With all the people and all the politicians, the generals get approved first. Maybe that's the way it's supposed to be. Maybe that's the way. Now, we have some folks right now in Afghanistan, right? And I think they hear me. There's about a six-second delay, but I think they hear me. Do you guys hear me? I think, maybe. Let's see how good we're doing. Yeah, they hear me. They hear me. They hear me. How is it over there? How's it going? Good. Go ahead. What question do you have? Don't be like these people. Don't be too tough on me. Go ahead. and Specialist Tia Newsom, uh, First, First Cavalry Division, United States Army. I would just like to say congratulations to your new position. Thank you very much. That's so nice. Thank you. Thank you. That's very nice. Thank you. We couldn't hear it too clearly, but I believe she just congratulated us, not me, us, us on this victory. And I want to thank you. Go. On behalf of Bagram Air Base. Go ahead. On behalf of Bagram Air Base, we'd like to congratulate you on being elected as a new president of the United States. Thank you very much. So nice. Thank you. By the way, I have to tell you, it's a 10-second delay, but I like them much better than I like the media, right? These are much finer people, nicer people. 
That's great. Thank you. Thank you very much. Go ahead. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, good morning, good evening, sir. My name is Sergeant First Class Philip Cavill. I'm with the Army, Illinois Army National Guard out of Chicago. Just want to say thank you for taking time to speak with us today. And congratulations on becoming the President of the United States, sir. Good. Thank you very much. That's really, really nice. Thank you. I will tell you, I'm with you all the way. You have somebody that's going to be right alongside of you. We're going to do it together. We're going to do it together. And Honestly, not only the support you've given me, the courage that you show is incredible, and it's going to be appreciated. It's appreciated now, but it's going to be appreciated more than ever before. You're going to see. Okay, thank you very much. Go ahead. Go ahead. Take one more. I love these 10-second delays, right? Gives you plenty of time to think about an answer. Such nice questions, though. Go ahead. Good evening, Mr. President. I'm Gunnery Sergeant Robert Gallup with the uh, Georgian liaison team, advising and assisting our uh, coalition partners here in Afghanistan. On behalf of uh, all the Marines here in Afghanistan, we'd just like to say congratulations. And good luck to you with your term. Thank you very much. Really nice. Thank you. And we're going to have some people going over and seeing you soon. And uh, you're doing an amazing job over there. How about taking one more? Go ahead. Take one more. Go ahead. I think he hears, right? Got it? You want to do one more? So far, I love these questions because every one is congratulate. I want to congratulate you. These are the nicest questions. Go ahead. Yes, sir. With the United States Army, I'm a 25 Sierra Satellite Communications Operator Maintainer. And I'd like to congratulate you on your inauguration, sir. You are the nicest people. But they're only nice right now to me. They're probably definitely not so nice in other ways. I want to thank you all. You are amazing people. We're with you a thousand, a thousand, a thousand percent. And you're doing a, a, just an incredible job. So thank you all very much. We will see you and keep fighting. We're going to win. We're going to win. We're going to win. Keep fighting. Thank you. Thank you all. Thank you all. be like that. Six questions and six congratulations, right? So this is very special. So we've done two of these, and we had big crowds, big, big, 10,000, 12,000, and I guess there's two more that I'm supposed to go to. You know, at some point I'm going to say, well, first of all, did you hear the speech today? And actually, even the media said the crowd was massive. So finally, you know, that was a big, that was all the way back down to the Washington Monument. That was it. And that was what was supposed to be rain turned out not to be rain. It was beautiful. It was beautiful. So let me just say this. You are special people. You are great, great people. I have your back. We are going to do great things for our country. You know, I ran, the journey started 18 months ago, and people said, we don't have a big chance. We went to number one about, would you say, two weeks or three weeks into the polls. We went to number one in the primaries, and then we just stayed there, and we did well. And it wasn't so much me. It was me. I did a good job as a messenger, but I'm your messenger. Just remember that. I'm your messenger. I'm your messenger. But it all began with a theme, and the theme is make America great again. 
And I've gotten to know the people of our country so well. I've been all over. I've been all over. And we had tremendous victories. And I will tell you, we have the greatest people on Earth. And we're not only going to make America great again, we're going to make America greater than ever before. So I want to thank all of you. You're very, very special people. Thank you. Say, say something. Thank you all for your service. I'm honored to be our First Lady. We will fight, we will win, and we will make America great again. Thank you. Every step of the way, and I will always love you. We Bittersweet memories That is all well I'm taking with me We both know I'm not what you you need and I Life treats you kindly And I hope well That you have all you Dreamed of And I wish you just And happiness But above all this to you.